into the engine. Um, our main aim is really to make it easy for people and projects and brands to enter the metaverse. Um, so a bit like this kind of live audio thing that we're sort of trialing now. Um, you know, no need to build, just sort of kind of do what you're already doing, send a couple of URLs our way and we'll get you in there. Um, alternatively as well, what we have is we're kind of a free to build platform so anyone can download our builder tools, start building a virtual space. Um, and then our primary sort of uh, business mechanic or play to earn mechanic is advertising. Um, so what we do is we uh, bring people in, players and creators, and then we bring advertisers in who then want to talk and advertise at those players and creators. Uh, and we split that ad revenue pretty much three ways. So 30% goes to the player, 30% um, goes to the creator if they've created a space and there's some adverts and you know a racing track or something like that. 30% uh, goes to Realm the project and 10% we spend on sort of improving social impact causes. So removing plastic in the metaverse and we'll remove plastic in real life, plant trees in the metaverse and we'll plant trees in real life. And that's proving to be really popular with this sort of Gen Z clientele. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for these introductions. Uh, Matt, in your introduction, you mentioned play to earn, which ex actually is opening for my uh, first question that I have for you guys. Uh, yeah. You saw that uh, last year uh, there was like this big boom in NFTs, gaming, and metaverse, uh, which is kind of like umbrella for all of this. And this all started with this play-to-earn narrative. But over the course of the year, we've seen that uh, there has been